Good evening, everyone. My name is Dr. Tyson McMillan, and it is my privilege to share these words with you during your celebration in Tyler tonight. Trio is near and dear to my heart, and I am a living witness. Looking back, the undergraduate years are the toughest years of the college journey. It is there where we learn the language and rhythm of academia. During these formative years, guidance is essential for success. I'm here to serve as a living witness that trio folks, you are the light tower that provides such guidance to first generation college students like me. The McNair Scholars Program gave me the preparation to go from zero degrees to an earned PhD. I acknowledge my parents, Danny and Marcy McMillan, who made the trip with me in San Antonio and were there to witness the wonderful 2014 Trio Trevors Awards celebration. My parents had me at the humble age of 17. One of the marvelous advantages of having such young parents is having the privilege of speaking to my great-grandparents in person through the years. Wow, how they shared such wisdom with me. I am reminded of my great-grandfather, Reverend Johnny Victory Harris, who said, Get your education, education, education. Don't just go to school for your dinner. His point was learn something while you are there. Indeed, I say that this I do every chance that I get. Each day I am reminded that I stand on the shoulders of giants who came before me. I am proud to acknowledge the giants that paved the way for me. Among them are my grandfather Vance Harris, Papa, and grandmother Marcellus Harris, Big Mama, both of whom recently passed away. When I can recall the strength of Papa and the solid rock influence and faith of Big Mama, I maintain the persistence to fight for my dreams and carpe diem seize the day in life. This motivation to be persistent in the face of many obstacles is key to success. I reinforced to my students at the beautiful Tarrant County College Trinity River Campus in downtown Fort Worth that completing your education is not about how smart you are related to the material. It's more so about how persistent you are in seeking to accomplish the endeavor. Have you ever had a paper make you cry? I'm not talking about just any cry. I'm talking about curled up in a fetal position, longing for your mama to bring comfort with your bottom lip quivering. That, my friends, is a dissertation. I'm thankful that TRIO, namely McNair Scholars, gave me at least a heads up of the rigor of the process. At the Penn State Conference, I recall a guest speaker who described the doctoral process as hard, H-A-A-A-R-D, indeed, but worth it. To paraphrase C.C. Winans in the classic song about a well-known sacrifice, it wasn't easy, but it was worth it. In a doctoral process, you start out as an unrefined piece of gold. Through the doctoral process, you are molded into a bright and shining manifestation. The PhD is not the end, it is but the beginning of new heights. Look behind every successful person, and you will see a train of individuals who made it possible for them to succeed. I am one such individual who has such a train. 
It is a train too long to mention in the time allotted here. I'm on a mission in life to educate other people as I myself become educated and to mentor other people as I myself receive mentorship. I endeavor to become a link in the trains of many others. My academic journey continues because of excellent folks who proudly serve in the Texas Association of Student Special Service Programs and the excellent folks who serve in programs like you have tonight here in Tyler and Trio. I am the harvest of the seeds planted. Thank you for your time and acknowledgement through this awesome award that I received and through the awesome acknowledgement that you are receiving on tonight. Have a wonderful night and it was my pleasure to speak with you through video on tonight.